Hey everyone, welcome back, and guess what? I have another Switch controller for everybody to see. So, Secret Barrier Smash and I were just walking around GameStop the other day, and she was having a really bad day. But as soon as she saw this controller, her eyes lit up, and from that point, I had to absolutely just get it for her. So I got it. So this controller might seem a little bit familiar because a few videos ago, I posted a Nintendo Switch PDP GameCube inspired Pro Controller. That's a tongue twister in itself, but it was actually the Pikachu edition. This is the same exact controller controller but it's just in the princess peach edition so this is gonna be sugarberry smash's um hey smash it's gonna be her super smash brothers ultimate controller and uh, it's, it's gonna have her mark on it's gonna be hers but with everything said i really just want to get into this controller because it is a really nicely designed controller it's white and pink and everything that a girl gamer could want but you know i know there's a lot of princess peach fanboys out there too so guys this one could be for you too as i said we got this from gamestop it's 24.99 but you can also get it from amazon walmart anywhere with the retailers that sell pdp products don't mind all of the peas popping in this because Princess Peach PDP. This is to be a pop galore today. But here's the instruction manual. Plug and play right into Nintendo Switch. And there goes some more peas. Plug and play. But one of the greatest things about this controller is that it comes with an extremely long 3 meter, about a 10 foot cable. But I really like the box art. It shows the whole Mushroom Kingdom right there. I generally, 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 I generally keep these. <laughs> <laughs> boxes because they have a nice theme and like to put the matching amiibo inside the box and hang it on a wall or put it on a shelf somewhere. It's a nice little scene, I guess. So this PDP controller replicates the Nintendo GameCube 8 access analog stick quite nicely, quite, quite nicely. And also the D-pad right there. Nintendo has always had a good D-pad and um, I hate the ones with the additional webbing that makes it kind of like a 6 or 8 direction D-pad. It's just horrible. Plus, minus, share, home, A, B, X, Y, and I love the little peach touches all around the whole controller behind the analog sticks on the d-pad on the x and y button but there's one thing i did not like about this controller is that they got lazy with the back and they just made it black why not make it peach or why not just make the whole controller white and i asked these questions but i already know the answer it's just to save money i mean it would have been a perfect opportunity to make it yellow to match her blonde hair you know for the current princess peach you know her hair isn't always blonde but having that yellow back would have been a pretty nice touch for paying homage to Princess Peach. <laughs> um, don't mind the phlegm. <laughs> <laughs> Back to normal, but one of the best things about this controller is that the C-Stick is removable and you can have two full-size analog sticks on this PDP GameCube stock controller. So, you know, the C-Stick is awfully small, but if you are a purist for the Nintendo GameCube controller, you're not going to want to change that. But if you want something with a little bit more surface area, a little bit more room for your thumb to maneuver those right analog stick moves, then the full-size analog stick will be the cap for you to use. Overall, this is a nicely built controller. It looks great, and I've been trying to prevent myself from saying this word. It is nice and clicky because I myself love clicky controllers. So if you're in search of a character theme controller for Smash Brothers, or if you're looking for something that just looks and feels a bit more custom, these controllers might be for you. I'll drop a link down below if you're interested. But since you're here, please remember to check out these other videos. And if you really like this video, please feel free to subscribe, as well as click that notification bell for all future uploads and updates. And one last reminder, follow me on Instagram at WowVJSLTR. And I'll see everybody soon. Have a great rest of your weekend and next week. Bye, guys.